We live here in northern Ottertail County on a 100 acre farm. It was a good place to raise a family. Yeah. Kids enjoyed it. Kids loved showing sheep at the fair. I was raised on a small farm in the Strawberry Lake area of the um, White Earth Indian Reservation. And I picked out the spot where I wanted to be and after 13 years I managed to have a little house built for myself and it was um, kind of on a hill surrounded by a meadow which were surrounded by trees and it was it seemed private, seemed safe, I loved it. Mm -hmm. um, so I lived there for 22 years um, and I eventually decided to move because of pesticide drift. You know, at first there wasn't a lot of potato fields, but then it seemed like every year there were a few more and a few more and a few more. They started spraying on us, and uh, the, they were spraying right next to the sheep. Then that winter, the winter of 96-97, one by one they started to die. We lost 29, 29 head. He cut one open and their livers were tan instead of the dark red, which means they were poisoned. You know, it was an impoverished community they came to. You know, a community that doesn't have the means to fight back because um, it's a lot of people are poor. Some days you could stand in front of that school or you could stand in that community and the smell of that chemical was almost overwhelming. It was so strong. <clears throat> we all got hit pretty hard and I knew after that that I had to get out of there that um, I wasn't likely to survive if I got hit like that again, and I left. It was really hard because I had family close by and really um, deep connection to the land. <clears throat> that place of the white clay that has been reserved for us. You know, we were supposed to come here. This was supposed to be a safe place for us to live in perpetuity. And it's not. We've tried talking with RDO directly and we haven't gotten anywhere so we would like McDonald's to put a little pressure on their uh, potato suppliers to grow healthier french fries. Um, I think people would care if they knew. Um, mm -hmm. I don't think people want their actions to hurt other people. I think we want our food to be grown in healthy ways. McDonald's, you may be one of the largest corporations in the world, but you're also part of our human community as well. And bears as much responsibility as anybody else, or more so, for what happens in these communities that are being poisoned year after year after year by the potato production.